everyone, my name is Haley and you're watching another Biteable tutorial. Today, I'm talking about infographics. I'll give you some tips and tricks for creating stunning infographic videos that clearly communicate your message. And I'll show you how to make one in Biteable. One of the most difficult parts of any job is communicating important information in a way that doesn't put your audience to sleep or confuse them. Enter infographics. Visual information, such as infographics, are a perfect method for representing both data and information and seriously increasing the chances your audience will understand your message. When creating infographic videos, there are tried and tested processes to follow. Here are my tips for getting started. My first tip is start with a template. It's way more important for you to focus on the information than the design, so hold onto your brain juice and use a template instead. Luckily, infographics are one of the most templated visuals, so you'll have a plethora of templates to choose from in Biteable. My second tip is share and share alike. Infographic videos are infinitely shareable and perfect for social media. Don't forget to include a CTA at the end asking people to share and think about the broader audience and context when creating your video just in case it goes viral. My third tip is start with a big opener. It's important to hook the audience straight away, so start with your most exciting stat or statement. My fourth tip is keep it compact. You might be tempted to include a ton of info and cover everything you can, but trust me, don't do it. Keep your video between 30 and 60 seconds, ideally as short as possible. If you need more screen time, consider breaking it up into several different videos. And my final tip is walk the line between visuals and text. If you use too much text, you run the risk of overloading your audience. Make sure you're generous with the videos and visuals to break up the text. And while you're at it, compress your text into key takeaways. You don't ever want to see a Star Wars style wall of text crawling across the screen. Here I am on Biteable's infographic video templates page. You can see we have dozens of different infographic video templates for you to choose from. To preview any, just hold your mouse over the thumbnail and then go ahead and click edit video once you're ready to start editing. Once you're in the Biteable Video Maker, you'll be able to customize this template so it suits your branding and your message. Go ahead and click into that first scene and we'll begin our edit. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about the results from our latest employee engagement survey. So I'm just going to edit this text to reflect that. And then you can go ahead and skip over to the next scene. That looks good. So I'm going to go ahead and pop into the third scene and this is where I'll start putting in some of my stats. So this will vary depending on the survey that you launched or the video that you're creating. But here are the fictional stats that I'm going to use in today's video from our biteable employee satisfaction survey. You can use the toolbar on the right hand side to edit your text, either make it smaller, change the font properties and the colors. So I'm just gonna shrink this down a little bit and then I'm ready to head over into the next scene. I'm just gonna repeat this step a few more times, adding in any relevant statistics that I want to include in my video so my staff is informed and up to date. And then this is where I'm going to kind of close my video out talk about what changes we'll be making uh, as a result of this survey, and then any last minute updates that I'd like the team to know. So in this case, I'm going to be hosting more team events, and they're going to be on Slack and in person. And then in this very last scene, I'm going to make it the call to action. This is where people can go to ask any of their questions. So if I had a Slack channel for HR or a specific email address, I would just pop it in here. Next, I'm gonna head over to the style tab and I'm really gonna edit the colors that you see in this template so it fits my brand. I'm gonna start off by changing the background color of these orange scenes and making it a nice light green color. Then I'm going to head over and change the color of the purple background scenes and I'm gonna make it just a lighter purple. You can also change the color of the animations from this style editor. Go ahead and click on the scene and then select the animation color and you can choose to change those here, both primary and secondary animations. This is a great way to see all of your scenes in one spot to make sure they all match and it looks cohesive. And once you like the way your scenes look here, head on over to the edit tab and we can finish editing our video. 
If you don't like any of the animations or if you want to add a scene transition, you can just click in that transition scene there. You can also add a soundtrack. We have over 80 different soundtracks for you to choose from. Since this is a template, there are already soundtracks and scene transitions added into the video for you. But to change those background animations, you just click on the scene, click the background, and then select Replace Background. From there, you'll be presented with all of the Guidable animations, and you can also upload your own photo to use in the background as well. So you can just take a look through all of the different Biteable animations. This is in our Diverse Workplace folder. And once you find the animation that you'd like to use in your background, just go ahead and click on it, and it'll automatically be replaced in your background. Then you can just drag it around on the scene to be wherever you'd like it to appear. Once you're ready, you can go ahead and export your video. From there, just click Build Video. You can copy it with a link, download it, or share it to socials. And if you share your video with a link, you'll also have access to all of these biteable analytics, including total views and viewer location. Next time you need some infographics, do yourself a favor and don't open Excel. Use Biteable to whip up clear, easy to understand infographics on your coffee break. Sign up with Biteable today and browse our massive template library at biteable.com templates. Don't forget to follow us, like, and subscribe for more tutorials like this. Bye.